And then I think clarifying roles, uh, yeah. you know, that, that's, I think, really important because everybody's not good at everything. Uh, you know, for instance, uh, as a leader, you surround yourself with folks where that they're very strong in an area you may not be as strong in, but collectively we get more done. Yeah. It's, and what I also love, again, in your story is some of your principles, so many of your principles could apply to really any organization. Absolutely. Higher education, not-for-profit, small business, large business. It's this whole balance of relational and operational. And building all those relationships, yeah. but operational stuff like we got to measure, we got to be really clear on our goals, we got to be really clear on our roles. We, you know, not not ask for feedback. Those those kinds of things. Well, I know you do some teaching and leadership, and and I would say one of the challenges we have in this generation, or let's just say, you know, the last twenty years, but it's getting more critical, is that so much of the work we do is transactional. Yeah. Right and it can be done with a computer, or we can have a, a Zoom meeting or a Microsoft meeting. Out in the world, things are done in relationship. And, and if, if I can do anything when I teach a class, it is to say that it is relational.